2020 brought us a presidential election. This isn't the biggest bag over the head punch in the face I ever got. God damn it! Unlike any we've ever seen before. Lots of questions, lots of concerns. So let's reflect and look back on the 2020 presidential election. Low life, snake licking, dirt eating, inbred, overstuffed, ignorant, blood suck. The 2020 presidential election. Heads up! Huh? Oh. Ah! Ah! The charismatic Joe Biden. All men and women created by the go, you know the you know the thing. And the brilliant Carmelia Harris. Wait, wait. I'm speaking. The important is you said the truth. Campaigning from their basement. And despite losing a large percentage of their base minority voters, the appealing Joe Biden. And the kids used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down. And the scholarly Kamona Harris. <laughs> managed to receive 81 million votes. That's 15 million more votes than the great divider in chief, Barack Obama. Wow. <laughs> in fact, the articulate Joe Biden Poor kids are just as bright and just as talented as white kids. And the dynamic Carlito Harris. What do I need to know? Like, what's the thing about the ice cream? He loves ice cream. You know, Tell me about well, that. Well, <laughs> We're so appealing that there are reports that people woke from the dead to vote for them. This is quite an amazing feat. Well, time out, time out. Hold, hold the phone here. This, this doesn't add up. What am I missing here? Stop, stop, stop. I can't understand the word you're saying. Take off your mask. Oh, boy. I said the fix is in. <laughs> you know, I really enjoy making these videos. I like to get some points across and throw some humor in there. Remember, these are just my thoughts, my opinions. I'm not actively looking to change yours. And I'm not asking anyone to change mine. Do you really want to live in a world where we all think and behave the same way? Hey, hey, wake up. Wake up, everybody. We live in a great country where we can have freedom to think, freedom to make our own decisions. It seems that we may be losing that. I hope, I really hope more people recognize that before it's too late. Stay home, but call your grandparents and your cousins.